And India, with its billions of people, can also do that. So now, all you have to do is turn on your television sets, at least in the Philippines. We see a lot of commercials, on a massive advertisement on TV of different food supplements, some for arthritis, some for diabetes. But let me tell you that many of them employ what you call nanotechnology. What is nanotechnology? It is actually isolation of the micronutrients in the process breaking up of the original components. Whereas we in DXN, if you eat our RGG Ganoderma capsules, it's like you went to the, or powder, as here in the UAE, it's like you went to the jungles or the forest and ate or cooked this Ganoderma there and ate it whole. Because we are giving it to you 100% pure, except the ones that, are, that come with the extract. I'm talking about the RGG powder. Now food supplements abound, but why do we now want to see them uh, about them more? It's because we now have the health revolution around us. We know that we are taking the wrong food. Many people know also that they are taking the wrong food, but they cannot do anything because they love to eat. And so America has reported already on adult obesity, translating later on to childhood obesity because we love to bring our children to the fast food chains at least once or twice a week and that is giving them a lot of preservatives artificial flavorings and uh, colors or whatever and the food that we love to eat usually are really wrong spicy oily so we should now thank that we have these food supplements to support us as i will tell you much later how they can do that so all you have to do now is pinch an inch of your fat at your side and you will know that you have this excess fat living there and uh, certainly our food supplements in the will be able to help you make these bodies for yourselves because they say the ideal body for a woman should be flat uh, no no tummy coming out or a, a man should be chiseled and muscled so everywhere i go i just share health awareness in the philippines i even conducted a survey asking people 90 years and above finding out what they have been eating all these years that they have grown old to such an age and i have one staple answer it's really fruits and vegetables being part of their diet every day so fruits and vegetables, that's, that only translate to healthy food. And here in DXN, we can have all the nutrients that we find in fruits and vegetables in simple capsules and tablets that is in our DXN products. And so I have to talk about obesity later, a very large uh, uh, issue because now it has become a global problem. And this I will talk about aside from telling you about our different DXN products. So when I examined what types of food are being eaten by the different people in the world, I found out that some are eating too much, while some are eating too little. So it is not good to eat too much, just as it is not good to eat too little, because that is considered malnutrition. The three letters mal meaning abnormal or bad. So that's considered bad nutrition. So now I will have to talk about obesity. Would you believe that my brother Ed and I, before DXN, were obese? He was obese at 248, I was obese at 190 pounds. Now, with the regular intake of our DXN, Ganoderma, RGGL, and Spirulina, we have decreased our weight and come to this uh, more physically fit looking and comfortable weight. Now, what is obesity? <laughs> Obesity is defined as an excess in body fat, 20% or more over a normal weight. And so therefore you all have to know what your normal weight is before you will know if you are obese or not. You can also have higher proportions.